Good evening, everybody. A few days looking at paint station thinking, what a mess. I had all of the different paints out on the desk, but no real place to store them. So I went onto Amazon, and I'd seen, for, for many years, to be honest, a lot of the MDF sort of options to this. And I thought, yeah, yeah I might go for that. And then it piqued my interest that there was a Perspex one on there. And I thought, even though it's showing nail polish, and I'm really not a type of bloke that would wear nail polish, um, you know, if you are, fair play. Um, so I thought, yeah, we'll give this a go. £22.99 is a little bit of a steep price point. However, I do think, in my opinion, it just looks a little bit, you know, cleaner, more professional, and actually a way that I could see all the paint pots really sort of easily. So I've ordered the, uh, the kit and it arrived today. Now, I was going to do an assembly video, but I'll talk about the reasons why that didn't happen in a few minutes. Um, assembled, it's absolutely brilliant. Really chuffed with it, and my paints look really nice. The light bounces off it. Lots of good points. On to the bad points. Um, so, if you're a big bloke like I am, and have big hands, it is very, very fiddly to put together. Uh, the little screws and the nuts that you need to hold don't leave a lot of room for your fingers to get in and hold it. Um, so it did take me a good probably half an hour. Uh, and this is a guy that sort of does car repairs and, and used to do um, restoration work. So, you know, I've, I'm certainly used to a massive amount of tools and this was really, really fiddly work. So if you've got small hands, or you've got somebody with small hands that could sort of help you along, I think the process will go a lot quicker. The design, really quick, really simple, um, very straightforward instructions, which I found really, you know, I, I didn't need to read them, but they were very useful, um, but just very fiddly. However, the finished article, really, really impressed with. Now, there are some different options, obviously, uh, online. You've seen the MDF and you've seen this. Uh, Ryan went on to eBay and managed to find pretty much the similar sort of setup as what I bought for half the price. The downside is it was coming from China. So, you know, if, you, if you're willing to wait for something like this, you can get it cheaper than the $22.99 that I paid. However, there'll be a time sort of constraint on that. For me, I was happy to pay the money and get it the next day. So, you know, a little bit of balance here and there. But overall, I'm really happy with this product. And I'd probably give it sort of a three and a half to four out of five stars. Uh, and that's purely based on the fiddliness of the assembly. Because if the assembly had been easier, I'd, I'd have given it five. Um, you know, the quality is absolutely great. And I'm really happy with the finish. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed this review. Happy gaming.